Hi Rockets. As we notice, the street signs are traffic signs around our neighborhoods, our communities, and in our city. We can stop to notice the specific characteristics of these signs. Things like what color the signs are. We can notice the numbers, letters, words, or symbols on the signs. We can notice the size of the signs and also the shape of the signs. And that is what we are going to do today. Today, we're going to work together to match traffic signs with their shape. This will help us to practice the names of the shapes and also practice recognizing um, shapes and telling them apart from other shapes. I'll be introducing you to a couple new shapes today too. I'm gonna turn my camera around so you can see what I'm seeing. Let's get started. All right, here we have some traffic signs and also some shapes. And we're gonna to work together to try and match these traffic signs to their shape. Hmm, which traffic sign should we take a look at first? Let's take a look at this stop sign. What do you notice about this stop sign? Hmm. Let's count the sides on the stop sign. Remember that we're looking for the shape that matches. A stop sign has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Do you see the shape that matches? Ah, here it is. It's right beside the stop sign. A stop sign is an octagon. Octagons have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight sides. Let's put our matches side by side, just like this. A stop sign is an octagon. Let's see if we can find another match. Hmm. Let's take a look at our yield sign next. What shape is our yield sign? How many sides does it have? I see one, two, three sides. Do you see a shape in our pile that has three sides? Ah, there it is. It's a triangle. A triangle has three sides, but wait a minute. Can both of these be triangles? Look, if we turn it around, they look just the same. Both with one, two, three, one, two, three sides. There, let's add it to our pile or section of matches over here. So far we found the stop sign, which matches with the octagon, and the yield sign, which matches with the triangle. Let's see if we can find another one. Okay, which one should we take a look at next? Here we go, this is a railroad sign. It means that there's a railroad crossing nearby. What shape is this sign? It's a round shape. What do we call this shape? This sign, the outside of the sign, is a circle. Do you see the circle anywhere in our pile? There it is. There we go. We'll add it to our pile of matches. A railroad sign is a circle. It has an X and two R's, but the outside of the sign is a circle just like this. All right, so far we've found three matches. A stop sign is an octagon. A yield sign, which means slow down, is a triangle. You might even call it an upside down triangle if you're used to seeing a triangle look like this. It's still a triangle, even if it's this way. And a railroad crossing sign is a circle. All right, we only have a few more. What shape is this sign? This is an interesting shape. Hmm, let's take a closer look. It kind of looks like a house. This is a sign that tells us that there's a school nearby. Let's count the sides on this sign. One, two, three, four, five. There are five sides on this shape. 
do you see a shape here that looks just like this with five sides? Here it is. A shape with five sides is called a pentagon. Can you say pentagon with me? Pentagon. Let's double check to make sure that this shape has five sides. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, a school sign is a pentagon with five sides. All right, we only have two more. Two more signs and two more shapes. Let's take a look at our speed limit sign. This sign tells us how fast we can drive. And this is a speed limit sign for 30 miles an hour. How many sides do you see? What do we call this shape? Yeah, it's a rectangle. All right, let's see. Do you see a rectangle here in our pile? Yeah, here it is. Four sides, two are a little shorter and two are a little longer. Hmm, wait a minute. It doesn't look exactly the same. What should I do? Ah, I just have to turn it and then it will look exactly the same as our speed limit sign. This is a vertical rectangle. There we go, it's a match. Rectangles have four sides, two are shorter, and two are a little bit longer. All right, so that leaves our last street sign is this curvy road sign. I see a curvy arrow on the sign, but the outside of the shape looks just like this. This is a rhombus. A rhombus has one, two, three, four sides. Someone in our class remarked, that a rhombus kind of looks like a square that's turned on its side. And someone else said, that looks like a diamond. This shape is called a rhombus. All right, let's add it to our matches. And we'll go back through our shapes one more time. We found the shapes that match with these street signs. Do you remember what the shapes are called? A stop sign has eight sides. Do you remember what we call this shape with eight sides? It's an octagon. A yield sign has three sides. Do you remember what we call this shape? It's a triangle. A railroad crossing sign doesn't have any straight lines. It goes around and around. This shape is called a circle. A school sign has one, two, three, four, five sides. Do you remember what we call this shape with five sides? A pentagon. This shape, the speed limit sign, is a rectangle. Four sides. Do you remember what's special about the sides of a rectangle? Yeah, two are shorter and two are longer. Here's our curvy road sign. It has four sides. It looks like a square turned on its side or a diamond. Do you remember what we call this shape? It's a rhombus. Wow, we found a lot of different shapes on our street signs. All right, Rockets. Today we were matching our street signs to their shape and practicing the name of these shapes. Maybe octagon, pentagon, and rhombus were new shapes to you. I wonder if you can spot a rhombus, a pentagon, or an octagon somewhere in your neighborhood. If you do, feel free to post a picture of it on Seesaw, or you can send it to me via email. I'd love to hear about it. I hope you had fun with this shapes activity and I will see you next time. Bye Rockets.